it's a little different, you know, because uh, um, just coming to you know, higher expectations, you know, finishing the year pretty strong, the bowl game, you know, got a lot of weight on my shoulders. Everybody wants to see what I'm going to do next. And so uh, this, this being a leader for the, for the other guys, for the other freshmen coming in, the other running backs coming in, and uh, just, you know, just lean by example this year. What was the toughest thing you had to deal with as a freshman? Toughest thing, uh, just earning respect from the upper class, you know, when you got you know, three guys that went to the NFL, uh, the K one, so with the Browns, so, you know, a couple guys that went to the NFL, you know, those, those, are, those are big guys, so just live up to their expectations and having them, you know, earning their trust. That was what, what, what point last year were you earning their respect? Um, I feel like I did decent throughout the season, but that bowl game when I had, you know, AD come up to me, you know, tell me, like, you're doing what you're doing, I was like the first time, and so. After the game? Uh, during the game, actually, you know, around the third, fourth quarter, when I had Aaron Donald come up to me and tell me, you know, you know, great job, keep it up. That that, that meant a lot. So I felt around that time was when I earned that respect from him. Now this year, you know, since you earned that respect, did it make it a little bit easier for you? Yeah, I feel a lot more comfortable. You know, things are going smooth, and so uh, just trying to do everything I can for the team on offense and defense. Are you, are you more of a leader this year? Than you? I would think so. I would I would say that you know, um, you know, with you know, leaders of offense, you know, is three spots, which is the quarterback and uh, the, off, the receiver and, uh, and the running back. So, Micha and Tyler, as far as the skill positions, you know, our old linemen, they're, they're the older guys, you know, they're seniors and stuff. So, it's their team. But as far as, you know, the, the skill positions, I feel like that's what it's Was there any point early last season where you might have trouble? You know, I'm not going to be able to earn the respect. Are you worried? Anything happened out on the field that you know, you're worried about? Uh, none of that, no. Uh, one game that comes back that I've been really done, I'm proud you know, of the Virginia game. You know, I had like 15 carries and I didn't have, you know, it was just embarrassing for me. So at that time, I was a little down on myself. But I tried to just pick it up as the season kept going. What's your thoughts on Chris James? You know, we, we just look at him, but we're not running backs <laughs> ourselves. What's your expert opinion uh, running back? On Chris James is a very good football player. You know, he just knows the game. He, he's, he's smooth, he's fast, he's physical, he's everything you need in a running back. And uh, I'm very happy, happy that he's on our team, you know, because for you to win games and be a great team, you need, uh, you know, depth at every position. And I feel very comfortable, you know, with him if uh, come game time if he's carrying the ball. How have you handled the first three practices of going back and forth from offense to defense? It's definitely tough, you know, but coach, uh, every day we have the slide shows and we talk about mental toughness and, uh, and physical toughness. So I'm just doing just little things uh, after practice, you know, with the cold tub and, and you know, just get my legs back and uh, just, just being tough and just sticking it out. Do you feel like you're in good enough shape that, that you're going to be able to handle it this year? Yeah, I, you know, but I always can be in better shape, you know. So I feel like I'm handling it uh, very well right now, but there's still some time to practice where I'm, I'm breathing heavy. And so, uh, but, you know, 20-some days to the season, so I'm going to do everything I can in these 20 days. Has it been tough to, to pick up any of this stuff when you're working with Coach Palermo, you know, the stuff he's giving you? Has that been tough? Oh, uh, yeah, some of the defense team has been tough, but we're at it every day. You know, anytime I get a little free time, I'm going up there and meeting with them. So, uh, and I feel comfortable day by day with earning this defense. Are you spending maybe a little bit more time on that? Because you sort of, I mean, I feel like you know, the offense you played in it all last year, you know, yeah. How's, how's your time split going, depending on the uh, first few times? I, I won't be on no special teams this year. Um, <laughs> not kick off, not kick return, or punt, or punt return. So uh, every time we start practice with the special teams, um, yeah. when they have the whole team has special teams, I'm with Coach Palermo. So the time that we spent in the meeting room and on the field, uh, special teams is my time with Coach Palermo. So it, it's a good enough time. You said you had so much success last year. Did you feel like you have to duplicate that? Is there any kind of thing on your shoulders? Do you have to do that again? Uh, yeah, I can. I could have done things better last year, but uh, I, I just get everything I got, and uh, whatever you know, my results, whatever the stats are this year, I'll be satisfied because I get everything I, I can. And that's all you can do. It's going to be one thing when you're in the season and you're playing a little DN against an opponent, but do you ever think about you know, when you're out here when you guys scrimmage you go live, you're going against an you know, offensive tackle who, on any of the other plays, you're going to expect a block for you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or maybe tackling a guy who's one of your position mates. I mean, do you ever think about that? It's got to be a little bit conflicting. I yeah, but at the end of the day, we're all teammates, you know, and uh, TJ, TJ's a heck of a, heck of a tackle. You know, I think he's going to do great things this year. And it's tough going versus him, but uh, I think experience going, uh, running past him, I'm happy he's blocked for me. Have you talked to any 